Time now for Kyle's Weather Classroom right here on Quad Cities today at 11. Just three more days until Christmas, and while this Christmas will be unusually warm, it's not necessarily going to be the warmest on record. So I thought we'd take a look at some of the Christmas extremes and take a look at how the last few years have shaped up. Well, let's get to the maps here, and you'll notice our high temperature, our record high temperature, 62 degrees. That was just a few years ago, four years ago, in fact, in 2019. The uh, warmest low temperature on record, check that out, 50 degrees in 1936. Now, this will be rivaled uh, when you wake up Christmas morning. It's going to be around 50 degrees. However, in the official books, it's likely going to end up in the 40s as we do have some cold air that's going to wrap around very late Christmas night. So, uh, technically, we go midnight to midnight for our uh, daily temperature records. So, we'll likely end up in the 40s that day. Uh, record low high temperature was two degrees below zero. Ooh, that was a rough one there in 1983. The record low was 18 degrees below zero in 2000. A very young Kyle remembers that very well because there was about 11 inches of snow on the ground. So that certainly was a white Christmas. Definitely not going to have that this year. A record precipitation was 72 hundredths of an inch in 1957. And in 1945, there's 3.8 inches of snow, which is the most snowfall on Christmas Day on record. So as far as the warmest Christmas is on record, as we just mentioned, 62 degrees followed by 50 in 1936, 58 in 1982, and uh, we go to 2021, 2021, 53 degrees. That's what we're forecasting here Christmas Day, so we could be tied here for number six, and then uh, we kind of rounded out to the upper 40s here in 1994. So normally our highs are in the lower uh, lower 30s, so it is going to be quite the warm one. Here's a look at the past five years. Uh, last year was a very cold one. We had 18 degrees for the high, 3 degrees for the low with 1 inch of snow on the ground. Otherwise, we have not technically had a white Christmas before last year. You have to go back to 2017, so about 6 years ago. So, uh, again, not a white Christmas this year. It will certainly be a wet one. Maybe, maybe it'll be a record wet one. We'll have to wait and see how things fare out on Christmas Day. We'll take a final look at your forecast coming up next.